All right, we're going to send things over to our first alert, Chief Meteorologist Scott Padgett. Today is actually feeling like the holiday. It's Finally. It's cold for Thanksgiving. Yeah, uh, it's going to warm up going yeah. into Sunday, but it's going to cool back down, Karen, going into next week. So that's nice. But take a look at the trend that we did see as we went through uh, today and the past few days. You can see that we did see... Well, I'm going to step out and out of the way here. You're able to see that we did have uh, a really warm trend for us. Temperatures near average on the 7th. And then as we were going through the past few days, temperatures well above average for us and remaining above average the past few days. Now, let's take a look at this. The temperature changed uh, yesterday, 75 degrees. Today, 62. So that's my forecast high. Finally, fall temperatures briefly. Uh, we have a first alert weather day today because of the coolest air since March in the forecast with that 62 degree high. Clywarm Park looking fantastic right now. If you like the cooler air, you want to get outside. We have 59 degrees. Even though we have this abundant sunshine, we have strong cold air evection behind the cold front that moved through overnight, and we saw these northerly winds holding on near 13 miles per hour. Wrapping around this area of high pressure continuing to build in. So we'll be in the upper 50s the next few hours to the low 60s this afternoon. It's a different story in the Pacific Northwest Big area of low pressure continuing to hold together. A bomb cyclone just happening with really low pressure dropping for us. Uh, you're able to see that a lot of rain falling through parts of California as an atmospheric river continues to pump the moisture there. We don't have it here in North Texas. We are remaining nice and sunny. That high pressure remains in charge. 58 right now in Denton. It's 59 in Mesquite to 57 in Bridgeport to 57 in Rockwall. About 60 right now in Arlington. Across North Texas, same story. Low 60s in Hillsboro to the mid 50s in Bowie to 52 in Graham. Uh, so the forecast high today, about 62 degrees. And that's why we issued the first alert weather day. We just issue these uh, sometimes for extreme heat or cold, but sometimes when we have that big change in the temperatures happening and we haven't seen it since March this cool. So that's why we just want to alert you to that fact so you can dress accordingly by forecast high today, 62 degrees. Last time we were at 60 was March 26th of this year. So we're going to be seeing our temperatures cooling down tonight into the upper 30s to the low 40s. We haven't seen this cool air since again, March 26th to March 27th. So uh, dealing with another cool night tonight, tomorrow warming back up into the mid to the upper. Uh, 60s for us going into Friday morning, upper 30s to the low 40s, and then temperatures cooling down slightly on Friday. But I want to show you exactly what's going to be happening for us as we go into the next few days. You can see very warm this month, but will we see a wet Thanksgiving? Eh, I don't think so. I think we're going to be seeing some wet weather leading up to it. Maybe on Wednesday, some spotty showers around. Other than that, we should be drying out. But our temperatures are all over the place the next seven days. 71 Saturday, Sunday near 80, and then the clouds increase as we get closer towards that front next week, Karen.